What is up, guys? Welcome back to the channel for another episode of Game Night with Retro. We're continuing the season here with the Denver Broncos. I'm coaching them without the services of Bobby Humphrey. So we're at uh, right now we're posting a record of seven and two. That's week eleven, and we're taking on the Los Angeles Raiders. So without further delay, let's hit to the field and let's get to it. Ball green, back from injury. Welcome to Mile High Stadium in the broadcast booth here. Always an interesting game when these two get together. Raiders win the toss and elect to receive. David Treadwell gets us underway. Not a very good kick. to the air first play. No, incomplete though. Marcus Allen up the middle. But he fumbles the ball. Nice. The Broncos have it. Wyman Henderson. All right. Fifty twenty-five. It's uh, a teal on me still forty-four twenty-five, so K's all good, so he's in the face the same power, good, good. Fifty twenty-five, well it's still on at least fifty-six thirty-one. Maybe we'll put Michael Young. All right, let's go ahead and put Sewell in here. He's a little bit better. I'm oh, good. We need to. We need all, we need all the help we can get. down and more. Well, that was a gutsy call, but sometimes if you feel it, go for it, right? Mark Jackson has the ball. Nice, down to the 15. Yes! Yes! LA to Steve Sewell. Broncos on the board. Put, 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 put. 
Yes, Michael Brooks, Sack Streeter, two yard loss. Streeter back to pass again. He's throwing deep for Willie Golf, who makes a diving catch. There goes Bo. Second and five. Ah, the defense overreacted there. They could have had him for. That's in the first quarter. Raiders on the move. Second and eight. Marcus Allen again. Third and three. Marcus Allen. Yes, he's tackled for no gain. Brings out the field goal unit. Jeff Jagger, the kick is up. And it's good. Raiders on the board. Down. Put, 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 put. Oh, what is about that play? Second time I call that play, Ricky Ellison gets a sack. Broncos looking at third and eleven here. Trying to get it to Mark Jackson incomplete. Tim Brown back to receive the punt. Pretty good punt by Mike Curran. They got him right away. All right. Marcus Allen's dropped for a six yard loss. Bo Jackson, they got him nice. Third and 14. It's a blitz. Michael Brock, Sack Streeter. Jeff Gossett punting out of his own end zone. Denver should get good field position here. Breaking the tail back to receive the punt. He's met immediately and he fumbles the freaking ball. Ah. And well, Bo Jackson, okay. Ah. Yes. Stuff like that bothers you, don't it? And with that, the Raiders have the lead. That is cheap. Talk about that is cheap. Freaking do your job on defense, make him punt out, and then that that freaking happens right there, right? Things just turn on a dime, didn't they? Ten to seven at the halftime. Denver really, Denver dominated. I'm gonna say Denver pretty much dominated the first half. But yeah, that, that fumble on a punt and return for a touchdown. Yeah, that, that, that does make a huge difference, huh? Ah. <laughs> uh.
Melvin Bratton, baby. Nice run. Yeah, freaking Bob Golick. I think my center Keith Carts must be on bad because Golick's just freaking coming through there. Melvin Bratton has the first down. He's got the more than <laughs> in the end zone. But with that, the Broncos take the lead. Sometimes you gotta be aggressive, right? When, when, when it's doable. It's like four to four, it's like, okay, if they don't pick this play, we should be able to do it. So it's a, a reasonable gamble, I guess, you know. Alright, back to business here on defense. For Galt. Overthrown. Gosh. Now hold on to the ball this time, Ricky. Oh, what a good punt. first, but he got help from a buddy. First and ten. Yes, L.A. finds Clarence K. all alone. Nice, held on the ball down to the 20-yard line. Pressure gets rid of it. Wow, it was somehow complete, but fumbled and out of bounds, and we just got the first down. Oh, yeah, a lot, of, a lot happened right there, like all at once, right? Okay, gee. Pitch out, Melvin Brat. He's got blocking. He's down to the two. Slip through there, quarterback speed. Yes. Treadwell adds tack on tax on the extra point. Broncos up 21-10. Nice. Feeling pretty good right now. Not gonna get too comfortable. Play X 
a bootleg. <laughs> Willie Galt was wide open, but he dropped the pass. Dropped it. Third and ten. There's a handoff. Marcus Allen. He's got running room. Didn't even make him fumble it. <laughs> Wishful thinking there, huh? Schrader back to pass. Complete to Marcus Allen. He looks like he's got a first down. striking distance here. That ain't over yet. Minute 43 on the clock. Raiders going for the onside kick. Denver's got it. Got time. He's still on deep for Mark Jackson. Double cover there. Thought we'd try to catch the Raiders off guard. Pitch out the brat. Surprised Raiders didn't take a timeout there. Third and three. Melvin Bratton has the first down. We're just going to let this time run down right now. One more play should do it. Yes. There's the gun. It's over. We won. We swept the Raiders this year. Yeah. One and one easy, you know, especially early in that first half after that, that freaking punt of the fumble. Melvin Bratton, 100 yards rushing today. How about that? 15 carries. We was dedicated, right? Clarence K had the big catch about 57 yard pass. All right, 21 17. All right. That that's a little. Um, yeah, what, what, sweeping the Raiders this time around, it's a little it's a little extra special, you know. I'm, I'm savoring the flavor right now. So, yeah, there you go. Okay, let's skip, finish out the week here, and we'll take a look at the standings. Jets six and four, Colts four and six, Bills three and seven, Patriots one and nine. So it looks like Miami is running away with that division. In the central we got the Bengals at seven three, Steelers six and four, Oilers four and six, Browns three and seven. There we are in the West. Oh good thing we did beat the Raiders because Kansas City won two, so there there we are both eight and two. And that's our next opponent. So talk about a big game, right? Division lead on the line, in week twelve. But uh, anyway, six, Seahawks are six and four, so they're still in the mix here. Chargers three and seven, and with that win, we put the Raiders down to two and eight. So sweet, right? Extra sweet. All right, NFC East. We got the Eagles at seven and three. Cowboys six and four. Phoenix six and five, Giants four and six, Redskins three and seven, and then the Central Bears seven and three, Vikings seven and four, Packers five and five, Lions five and five, Bucks two and eight. Yep, and then this yeah, forty nine. I think they was off seven and three, Falcons six and four, 
Rams four and six, Saints two and eight. So there we go. So you can see we got week twelve is yep Denver Kansas City at Arrowhead Stadium. So definitely should be a definitely a big game, huge game, biggest game of the season. But for right now, we're gonna we're gonna enjoy this win over the Los Angeles Raiders, right? <laughs> One that wasn't necessarily pretty and easy, but hey, against them when those running backs, you, coaching, yeah, if you can come out, you come out with a win, then you feel pretty good about it. Anyways, guys, that was my th that's my thoughts on the game. Leave me yours in the comments below, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. But if this is your first time to the channel, tap subscribe. Then the bell, ding ding, so you're notified when I upload new videos. So until next time, guys, keep it retro.